be visiting uh, Malaysia and to have this opportunity to meet you, uh, with you. The media play an important role in all democratic societies, informing the citizens, facilitating discussion about important matters of public interest. As the first Asian president of the International Criminal Court, or uh, ICC, I am this week uh, visiting Southeast Asia uh, to raise awareness about the ICC, its role and mandate. I also hope to inspire the countries in this particular region to conduct informed consultations about the possibility of joining the ICC by ratifying the Rome Statute. I was greatly honored this morning to deliver a keynote speech at the second Asia-Pacific consultation on the universality of the Rome Statute. It was a unique opportunity to reach out to legislators uh, from more than 10 countries of the region at a time when Asia is severely underrepresented in the ICC. I would like to express my appreciation to the Parliament of Malaysia for hosting this particular event which is one more manifestation of the long-standing commitment of parliamentarians for global action to promote the universality and full implementation of the Rome Statute. I'm also looking forward to my meetings with the Prime Minister and the Minister of Law and the Attorney General and the Deputy Foreign Minister of Malaysia during my stay in KL today and tomorrow. Ladies and gentlemen, the ICC is clearly becoming the international community's instrument of choice <coughs> in the global struggle against impunity. Less than two weeks ago, the Security Council of the UN took an unprecedented unanimous decision to refer the whole situation in Libya to the International Criminal Court. 